Hey guys, it's Jennifer from LuLaRoe by Jennifer and Ellen. And um, I just wanted to pop on this morning because it's a little bit gloomy here in um, good old Westchester, Pennsylvania. So I thought what better way to brighten up our Monday morning than to do a styling video. And for those who caught my, um, those who caught my live video on um, pattern mixing, it was one of those things I've been wanting to get into and to do some styling videos and kind of share with you some of the things that I have learned um, in in fashion and styling. And um, last week, or I guess it was really two weeks ago, we talked about pattern mixing and how to not only style your LuLaRoe, uh, but just patterns in your closet, how to put them together and really maximize what's in your wardrobe. So today what I'm going to talk about is maximizing the maxi skirt. And I'm sorry, I can see someone's popping on. Hey, Amy. Um, but it's my phone so far away, it's hard to see um, who comes on. So what I'm going to do today, as you can see, I am wearing just the basic uh, LuLaRoe maxi skirt. And um, I paired it with, right, right now, I'm have it with my leggings and a basic black tank top just so that I can show you the different ways to wear it. I'm going to show you six different ways to wear your maxi skirt and I'll give you a few styling tips and different ways um, to kind of dress it up, dress it down. So as you can see, I'm wearing it the simple way as a skirt, as the maxi skirt, you know, was designed. So what I have right here is I have it folded down. Um, this is great for those of you who are shorter because you can shorten the length of the skirt. Um, so here's way one. The other way you can wear it, just as the skirt, is to wear it pulled up. This is how I often wear it. I just like the look of having the wider waistband um, and coming, you know, pulling it up a little higher on my waist. The third way to wear it as the skirt is to pull it all the way up under your bust line. And then it almost gives it the look, especially with a tank top, it almost gives it the look of a um, dress with that empire waistline. So these are the three different ways that you can um, wear your maxi as the maxi skirt. And there's one other way that I actually um, will often do. Pull your skirt down, and all I do is I take it from the bottom and pull it up. So you can see what I did here. All I did is I took it from the bottom on the side, and I pulled it all the way up. And then all you're going to do is you're going to take the bottom of your skirt and just kind of tuck it in to your top there and then you just want to kind of play with this a little bit so that it gets covered over and I will often tuck the front in as well and as you can see what I did here I'm gonna come a little closer so you can get a better look I almost made it into like a um, Grecian goddess type um, it's got the the layering right here it gives it a little bit of um, interest on the side and this is just a different way to wear your maxi skirt as a maxi skirt okay so here those were your four ways as a skirt um, the other way which most of you already know is to just take your skirt pull it up and there you go you've got a little cute maxi dress obviously I would not wear the tank top underneath I'm just wearing it today for purposes of the video. So again, super cute, easy way to wear your maxi. You had it as a skirt, pull it up, and then you have it as, um, as a dress. So now we're gonna get into some of the fun ways. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna show you how to turn the maxi skirt into a vest or a shirt, depending on how you wear it. So all you're gonna do is just like I did with the skirt with the tuck-in, you're just gonna pull the front up, just like that. So all I did was I, you know, just take it from the bottom and pull it up. And now all you're going to do is flip it over your head. Okay? Super easy, guys. Super easy. So then you just want to take your top and tuck it in so that it lays nice. And as you can see here, I have an amazing, super adorable little vest. It's great. Wear it with leggings like I am right now. You can throw it on with jeans. Um, there's a thousand, throw it on with one of your skirts. And what I love about it is it actually gives it like a little bit of a halter back. Um, so again, here it is as the back. And if you want, um, take one of your belts. I have here one of those super stretchy uh, belts. All you do is just put your belt on. 
And if you want to keep it open like this, I mean, that's a great way. I am ready for a Saturday night. I can throw on a pair of black strappy sandals, grab a little clutch, and I am good to go for a Saturday night outing. Um, if you want, you can also take your, just kind of wrap it. I take one side and, and cover it and then put your belt back on. And now you've almost turned it into a little bit of a shirt. And it almost gives the look a little bit of, and I love this with leggings. How cute is this? So easy way. So I just showed you three different ways to wear it as a vest, okay? And one of the other things that you can do, which is one of um, my favorite, we're gonna get a little tricky here. I'm gonna show you how to turn it into a wrap shirt. So again, you're gonna be in, in your simple vest start, and all you're gonna do is you're gonna pull the back up so that it hits about at your waist so that you can get as much fabric here as you possibly can. And then all you're gonna do is you're gonna take them and twist. No, I actually like to do it this way. I like to go right over left. You're gonna take and you're gonna twist, pull behind you and tie. So all I did was just pull behind and tie. So let me just get it tied and then I will show you. Okay, now once you're tied, you're gonna just use your mirror, use it, you know, and just kind of adjust your layers, make sure that you're not folded under. Um, and then I like to kind of open this up a little bit. This is a great thing to do if you have a bandeau bra. Um, and look, there it is. Turned it into a cute little um, wrap shirt. You could put this on with another maxi. You could throw it on with jeans. You could throw it on with leggings, whatever you want. So look at that. Maxi turned into a little wrap um, shirt. So the next way I'm going to show you. This is gonna get, we're gonna get a little more tricky here. So take your maxi skirt and make it right. So, all right, here we go. I got my maxi skirt. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn it upside down, okay? So here's the top of my maxi, here's the bottom. So you're gonna step in and pull it up. Wherever you want the length of your, this is gonna turn into a dress, guys. So wherever you want your dress to hit, is where you should place it onto your thighs. So all you're gonna do, so you can see what I did here, you're gonna pull it out, and I pull it against my back flush, and then take your two sides right here, and all you're gonna do is tie it behind your head like a halter top. Okay? And again, like I did with the right, all you're gonna do is take, because I can see how it's flipping, to the wrong side all you want to do is flip it under so that you see the right side of the fabric and you're going to do the same back here flip the underside in so you only see the proper side of your fabric there we go and then again adjust the front and if you want you can shorten this a little bit and this is again you can either wear it with a tank top like i am now or i if i was wearing this out i would put on a bandeau bra um, in a fun super color and that way you won't see the straps in the back um, but it'll give you the coverage that you want right here so how cute is that and again I think it looks awesome with leggings you could also forgo the leggings and just wear it as a dress and if you want to dress it up a little bit I'm bringing out my belt again go ahead put that belt on and what I like to do is I like to pull up the top so that the bottom is tight so it gives the look of a like skirt with a top. And how cute is this outfit? I mean, this is the kind of thing you could, you are set to go. If you were to go on vacation and take just one or two skirts, you could get so many different outfits with um, just these few pieces. So again, how cute is that? So easy to do guys. And then um, another way, now that you have your dress on here, I'm pulling out a second maxi. And all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this maxi on on top. Blast my shirt out a little. And look, now I have a super cute top and, a, and, and with a maxi skirt. So this is just two maxis that I have on and I've showed you um, how fabulous you can go from, um, you know, simple skirt to crazy outfits. Um, you know, I forgot to show you one of the simple um, little tricks. I'm gonna show you another one. Before I show you the last way to wear the maxi, I um, want to show you one last one that I kind of skipped over. 
um, because it is one of my favorite ways to wear the maxi. So I'm gonna go back to putting the maxi on. I can't, if I can get it untwisted here. Here we go. So I'm gonna show you um, one other way if you wear it as a dress. So I'm gonna put it back on as I'm wearing, as if I was wearing it as a strapless dress. And then what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna take my second maxi, throw it on, and just kind of tuck it in. And I'm gonna fold it down. Blouse my top out a little bit. Gotta make sure my skirt's tucked in. There you go. And now I have a cute little tube top with a maxi skirt. Again, I would not wear the tank top underneath. I'm just doing it for the purpose of the video. But this is a great way to kind of mix up your styling and do something a little bit different. No one has to know that you're wearing a maxi skirt on top and a maxi skirt on bottom. Um, and then I have one last way to show you guys, which is my favorite way to wear the maxi. For those who saw the picture I did the other day of the one-shouldered dress, that was this skirt. I turned this simple black maxi into a dress that was fit for a um, black tie affair. So, so easy. And you could do it in the patterned, you know, any patterned one. I find that these look sometimes are easier with the slinky material because they have a little bit more stretch. Um, so again, start with it as your basic black maxi. And then all you're going to do is you're going to pull it up to the strapless look. And then whatever arm you like the most and kind of want out um, is the arm that is going to stay out of the fabric. So I like to have my right arm exposed. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my left arm and I'm going to put it through my skirt. So I'm going to do that again for you so you can see what I did. All I did is I took my one arm and put it into the skirt and then that's step one. Now with this you're going to need a belt. So I'm pulling out my trusty belt. So all you're going to do is you're going to wrap your belt on you and with this as you can see as I start to put the belt on it makes the fabric want to come forward. That's okay if that's how you want to wear it. I personally like the look of having that behind me. So all you're going to do is put your belt on. And then I take my fabric and I'm going to tuck it behind. So the piece of fabric that's in the back, I'm going to tuck under. And then, hold on guys. I, got, I like the belt going the other direction. It's easier for me to maneuver. All right, there we go. Okay, so all you're gonna do, take your fabric and tuck it to the back. Come a little closer so I can see the mirror. So there you go. So now, and you make sure you're giving yourself, make sure you can pull your arm up so that you have room to move. There's nothing worse than being in a dress and not able to move. So there, this is look one. I like have sometimes having that high neckline, I think gives it a little bit more drama. So if you want, you could totally wear it like this. You have a gorgeous draped sleeve here and it almost gives like the, the ruching effect across the um, front here, just because of the way the dress is pulling. And it's got a very interesting back because of the way the fabric lays, it gives it a little bit of edge. Um, so okay, here's look number one. You got the high neck exposed arm and a beautiful draped sleeve. And then if you want, to show a little more skin, all you have to do is pull down so that your shoulder is exposed. So now you have almost like a strapless look, um, but you still have full coverage on your arm. The other way, which is how I photographed it, is put your sleeve back up, and all you're gonna do is you're gonna take the bottom of your arm and pull it up. And that will kind of give you a little more fitted look on the sleeve, and if you want, you can also fold down the top. And now you've got an interesting effect across here. You have a shorter sleeve, less blousey. Um, and you know, it's just a different way to style it. So there's a thousand different ways that you can do it. You can change your belt out, um, do some funky shoes. And even if you did something like this, um, which I did post a picture of the other day, I had this as the one shoulder dress and I had a plain black belt with it. Um, just a fun way for, you know, throw on a pair of uh, little flats with it. 
um, and, and it's a great thing to, you know, wear out to dinner or to lunch. Um, so these are some of the few ways that I have found to wear the maxi. I'm a firm believer that just because something is meant to be a skirt doesn't mean that it should be a skirt. I think fashion is about being creative and it's about stepping outside the box and finding new ways to wear the clothes that you already have. Um, so I hope you guys all enjoyed the video that I did today. I'm hoping to do these, um, I'm hoping to do them once a week, if not um, every other week. If there's something that you guys would like to see or would like to learn how to do, just let me know. I would gladly um, do a video, video for you guys because um, I'm here to help you and to teach you how to do all these super fun things with your Lululemon clothing. So thanks again for tuning in. Um, and I hope to see some of you tonight at our live, or excuse me, at our open house. And if not, I will see you guys all Wednesday on our um, online sale. Thanks, guys.